Hey guys, what is up? It is Smasher here. Welcome back to yet another Brawl Stars video. Today, the brand new update officially dropped and I'm going to be trying out Surge's brand new Hypercharge. So if you guys are going to enjoy this video, then hit the like button down below. And if you are add new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. So... Surge's hypercharge is called level 5 and basically he gets an additional level that makes his projectile split no matter what and it gives him increased range and I've played around with this hypercharge a little bit and I actually think it's a little strong. The good thing about this hypercharge is that I believe you can get it in only 10 hits, which is kind of insane to think about it. The fact that you can get his hypercharge in only 10 hits is a little insane. So let's go ahead and get right into some games and I am going to be showing you guys his brand new hypercharge. I hope you guys are enjoying the updates i know it just officially came out and i know that the spongebob season does not start until september 5th so we're not going to be getting you know all the spongebob skins but let's go ahead and get right into it and um, i had to get the offer with the you know the cool pin and i haven't equipped the icon but also poco got a new hypercharge Mortis got a new hypercharge. Um, who else? Tara, Squeak, Nani. They all got new hypercharges, but the one that I'm most excited about is Surge's hypercharge. Because I feel like his hypercharge is going to be a little bit too strong, but not like OP. Which I think is a good thing because we don't need any like OP hypercharges. But I do think that Mortis's hypercharge. I think is going to be the best out of the hypercharges that came out in this update. So as you can see, we are about two hits away from getting our hypercharge. It is actually a little crazy. So I want to wait until we get the hypercharge or I want to wait to use our super until we get the hypercharge. So we are one hit away from getting the hypercharge. So Jesse's going to put down hers and just absolutely wreck. And, um, I'm gonna do this. And we're gonna go ahead and activate the hypercharge. Now, as you see, look. Split range. And y'all saw that range, right? The range was a little crazy. I really didn't get much use of it, but probably in the next game, we will get a little bit of use out of this hypercharge. And we're gonna easily take game one. I should have used it when I had ammo. I, I, I kind of should have used it when I had ammo, but you saw his range. His range is pretty much like Piper's range. It's kind of crazy to see how far that range is. Um, I am probably going to be doing a montage very soon. Please tell me this Mortis has the hypercharge. I would love to see it. Okay, Mortis has his hypercharge, so we're gonna test it out, man. Because I think that Mortis' hypercharge is gonna be the strongest one out of all these hypercharges that are coming out. And I'm just gonna wreck the Nita and the Colette. So we're already level two. We're already halfway to our hyperchargers. is still crazy. I don't know if they're going to nerf it in the next update. Probably not. I don't know. But I think once Mortis gets his hypercharge, it could be game over. Because Mortis' hypercharge is actually kind of insane. So I'm going to go and back off because I'm very low on health. All right. Nice super from Mandy right there. So I need to try and um, approach. Dude, this Mandy is kind of cracked. I'm not even going to lie. Alright. We're two hits away from getting hypercharged. Um, so we're going to need to kind of... Try and use it wisely as best as we can, honestly. Um, we're juking the Colt. 
And um, Mortis just uses Hypercharge. But we're about to get ours. We're about to use ours. All right, we're going to go and use our Hypercharge. Look at this. That range is insane, dude. I feel like the range is going to carry it a little too much. But, dude, his Hypercharge is pretty nice. I like it. And let's just not forget the fact that Mandy absolutely popped off. And kind of carried our team. So, I also wanted to tell you guys that... I did get Rico's Mastery, like, a couple days ago, and I think Surge is probably going to be the next brawler I want to get his Mastery with, because obviously he just got his brand new Hypercharge, and he's one of the most fun brawlers to play in the game, in my personal opinion. Um, but let's go ahead and get into another game. I really want to try and use this Hypercharge to its fullest potential. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Ooh, let's see if uh, this Poco has the hypercharge. And he does. Okay. This is going to be cool. Um, this is going to be a little bit difficult to approach. Um, I don't think I'll be able to approach any of these guys. I have no idea. This Amber is trying to get me. They have a lot longer of a range than I do. Okay. I just wasted a gadget, bro. What am I doing, man? But at least I got the level two. That's all I that's all I pretty much needed. Alright, we're one hit away from super. We're about halfway towards our hypercharge. This amber is kind of annoying though. I do not like going up against Ambers, man. Ambers are, like, the bane of my existence. They can just auto-aim. Oh, no. I do not like the gadget. The gadget is really scary. We need to try and make a play here. Poco has his hypercharge, so we could actually make a good play here, because basically what Poco's hypercharge does is that the overhealing that his super does, instead of doing healing, it will give their teammates a shield, which is pretty stupid, honestly. Alright, we're gonna try and go in. Okay. There we go. So, yeah, you can see the Poco has a shield. I don't think we'll be able to use, um, Surge's Hypercharge. Alright, you know what? We'll, we'll use it the last second. But, I do feel like, um, Surge is going to be a little bit more meta now. With this hypercharge, I don't feel like he's going to be the strongest brawler in the game. I honestly think that the strongest brawler in the game could potentially be Mortis. And I think it's going to be a little scary to see how good Mortis is going to be with his hypercharge. I think he's going to be one of the strongest brawlers in the game. Because pretty much what his hypercharge does is that it doubles the damage and it doubles the healing. So it pretty much comes back like a boomerang. Kind of like, you know, Charlie's attack and Carl's attack. It's going to be insanely good. If Mortis players can really utilize this hypercharge to its fullest potential, Mortis could be the best brawler in the game. And... It wouldn't even be close. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. I probably didn't use Surge's Hypercharge to its fullest potential, but I at least used it and showcased it to you guys. So if you did enjoy this video, then hit the like button down below. And if you are out of new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!